responsibilities, end quote. The challenge remains with decision makers in WHO, governments, and the international community in finding ways to make these newly listed essential medicines affordable without breaking the bank. The WHO EML is often used as a benchmark for priority setting and procurement decisions. As countries wrestle with affordability, affordability issues, they should be encouraged to seek WHO's technical assistance in using lawful pathways to ensure that these treatments are widely available by regulating or eliminating monopolies, including through the granting of compulsory licenses. Furthermore, in relation to document A68 oblique 11, appendix one, we propose the creation of a WHO convened roundtable focusing on two possible government-led approaches to enable more efficient control of NCD cost. The first question addressed would be on how to bet achieve better transparency of the true cost of R&D of cancer drugs, for example, on small molecule and biosimilars, clinical trials, and the disclosure of public funds. The second question would focus on how we should implement effective mechanisms delinking the cost of R&D from the price of cancer treatments and providing life-saving medicines to cancer patients in all countries. Without delinkage, we will never achieve universal health coverage and resilient health systems will remain but a distant hope. Thank you, Mr. Chair.